This is a walkthrough of the Joint Manta storage service. The simplest way to put files into Joint Manta is to use the command mput. Here I have a file with Shakespeare's play The Tempest in HTML. To retrieve the object, I use mget. Now I'll run a compute job on this one object. Joint Manta has all of the typical text and data processing commands that you'd expect in a Unix-like environment. I'll search for the lines where the word thou appears with the grep command. Let's dig a little deeper. Joint Manta has a true directory hierarchy similar to a file system. I previously uploaded the rest of Shakespeare's plays into this directory. The command mfind lists those files like the find command you're familiar with. I'll use that to feed it into the mjob. These computations are actually map steps for a map reduce system. Now I'll add a reduce step to mjob to simply count the number of lines containing thou. Again, I'll leverage a Unix command, wc, to count lines. Awk here will count up all of the lines from all of the files. There, 7001 lines with thou in it. Those other two numbers are the number of words and the number of characters. Let's try something with images. Here's one. I've uploaded a few already. This command here uses the processing library ImageMagix's convert command. ImageMagix is one of the hundreds of data processing packages preloaded on Joint Manta. In this demo, I'll convert them to thumbnail objects. And instead of on the interactive command line, I'll save them back to the file. Let's take a look at that Manta title in PNG format now. I've exported it to a PNG. And there it is. It's easy to put log data into Joint Manta. There's a REST API and wrapper SDKs for Java, Ruby, Python, and Node. So let's go on to log processing. I've uploaded about four days of Wikipedia traffic data. Total size is over 17 gigabytes broken down by hour. I'm going to find the total number of pages requested and total number of bytes sent. I'm adding up the third column and fourth column of each file, and then we'll add all of those together. You can see here the mfind command goes through all the page counts. The mjob create looks for the third and fourth column. And then a reduce step here aggregates that all together, and then mpipe puts that into an object grandtotal.txt. Right now, Manta is distributing the work across 98 different tasks and just consuming the objects, and then, then prints the result. In less than a minute, we've crunched through all that data. To learn more about Joint Manta Storage Service, visit joint.com. Thanks for watching.